So we are here um, at the BioVac. This is our last visit for the delegation under the leadership of the DG of the World Health Organization, Dr. Tedros Ghebreyesus, and the Minister of Belgium, uh, um, Madam Christry. And I think this is quite an exciting visit because it really wraps up uh, the components of the mRNA Technology Transfer Hub. This facility here is one where as soon as the vaccine has been developed, and it has been approved, it will actually be manufactured here. So the local manufacturing of mRNA tech-based vaccine uh, for COVID and obviously with time with other areas like malaria, tuberculosis, HIV and AIDS, they will actually be manufactured in this particular facility. We're very excited that we can showcase that um, South Africa, Cape Town and particularly Biovac is going to play its part in reducing the pandemic which we all hope you know, will be reduced at some point. So we're very, very proud that we are part of it and that we can show the international team that this is essentially what uh, South Africa, together with others, uh, is capable of. And today we have showed you um, how our labeling machine runs. So this machine is responsible for labeling vials that are filled with product. Um, it's got its own checks for quality, making sure the correct information is actually on the labels and they come out at the outfeed. Um, our delegates today um, came in and I had explained to them exactly how the machine runs and showcased how it's labeled. And I'm quite pleased that the visit went very well. Uh, we've been having some discussions with both the Minister and the DG of um, World Health Organization and they are quite excited with what they have seen here. And you can actually also see the fact that in preparation for the uh, local manufacturing, there are facilities that are already now being constructed and we're hoping that sometimes during this year, these facilities will be ready for manufacturing. And that means really, as South Africa, we are ready to start that journey of being self-reliant, not only for ourselves, but also to support the rest of the continent with uh, vaccines that would have been manufactured locally.